Disabling user account control was one of my least popular tweaks in my previous series of videos. Now the reason I decided to add this again is because I wanted to elaborate a little further why I disable user account control. Mostly it's because it interferes with most users experience. In other words, when you try to open a program, you always get this pop-up, and most people, by pretty much negligence, stop paying attention to when this prompt comes up, and they just mindlessly click yes or no. And also, for a lot of people, if they don't need user account control because they're comfortable with their current security level, I like to give them the option to disable it. So let's go to our Metro UI here, and we're going to bring it up, and we're going to start typing the word user account control control. And on the right hand side you're going to notice in the search results that we're going to select settings and then on the left hand side it lets us choose the option change user account control settings. And go ahead and click that. User account control is pro it prevents potentially harmful programs from making changes to your computer and it just notifies you when they when they are started to change. Now you can modify this slider to always notify all the way down to never notify. And so pretty much you can do whatever you'd like and whatever you feel comfortable with. Personally, I like to go to never notify because I don't like to be notified every 10 seconds of something that's going on. Once I've selected never notify, I'm going to select OK. And it's going to, of course, notify me. And I'm going to select yes. And that will prevent future uh, notifications on startup. Let's see if it does it immediately or if it'll actually wait. Let me go ahead and launch it. It does do it immediately. So that, in my opinion, does help improve usability for a lot of users who aren't that concerned with that part of their security and making unwanted changes. So that's all there is to it. All you have to do is disable user account control in this video, and it'll help improve your experience and usability of the Windows operating system. So make sure you tune into the next video, and remember you can swing by the community at any time, pcmtechhelp.com forward slash community, and ask questions. My name is Craig Chamberlain, and you're watching the PCM Tech Help Show.